Hey everybody, how's it going? I know I made a video about this a while back. I've made a few videos talking about this. I have mentioned it before in my previous videos. I even made a joke, or you know, just as a general question for you guys, um, about the possibility of making a particular channel. Life lesson videos, life lesson channels, are flooding YouTube. It's been almost like a trend now at this point. There's so many of them at this point. Uh, there's the king of all of them, which is Darman Studios, and just recently, well, fairly recently, uh, he made a feature film. He made a feature film. Now, some would argue, well, it's an hour and a minute, an hour and two minutes long. Well, if you actually look up the, you know, what uh, people define as a feature film it varies usually they say anything past an hour is considered a feature film anything that's under an hour is considered a short film so needless to say he's already made a feature film he might make more in the future who knows but anyway darman is at the tip top tier of these life lesson videos now the thing is with darman's videos Yes, are they cheesy? Are they Hallmarky? Are they very Disney Channel esque? Yes, but what separates him from some of the other Life Lesson Channel videos is there's effort put into the videos. There's production value. They look great. There are sets. There are props. There's an actual studio. There are some great grounds of very professionalism. And from what I've heard from people who have worked with Darman, they say that it's a pleasant atmosphere, everyone gets along well, and that they genuinely have a good time, and that they feel they're telling a good message. That's all fine. That, that's all fine and dandy. That's all good. I am not here to um, to down Darman or in any way, because you know he's, he's doing great, and he seems like a good guy. He seems like, all in all, a, a pretty cool guy. What the my issue is... There's other life lesson channels I feel are just there writing this zeitgeist of, hey, this is what's trending on YouTube, let's make, you know, more videos. And the thing is, sometimes there's no effort put into them. I feel like there's no effort put into them. They just have a basic idea, and it's like, hey, let's do this. And here's an example. There's one channel called Generation Hope. Now, Generation Hope seemed like at first they started off like, hey, wanting to tell good messages, but then at this point... As the videos get later on and start getting more over the top, crazy and bizarre, it's like, wait, what? The actions that happen in their videos and their short films, or whatever you want to call them, it's like, okay, there's a difference between being a jerk and doing a felony hate crime. Or, yo, a felony. Um, and it feels like that they kind of know it's a joke, so they're not... It's like they're winking in the camera, in in a way. Um, and the thing is, with there is sometimes with maybe a couple decent actors sprinkled here and there, it's better. It's one of the better channels, but even that is a stretch because a lot of times it feels like the actors aren't even you know, trying to do anything, not not trying to make an effort. And then there's tomorrow's teachings, which don't even get me started. Tomorrow's teachings. That channel is a big joke. Uh, but the one channel that I feel like is pretty much saying, oh yeah, we're, we are a satire, and that is Samir Bhavanati. Samir Bhavanati's videos have pretty much feel like a parody of Darman videos. So much so, in one of his videos, he even makes fun of Darman. He has a character called Carman, who does, you know, life lesson videos. It's very self-aware, and it's like, okay, we're making fun of Darman. And he tries to say, there, no, 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 I, I have no ill will towards Darman, we're just making a satire, and hey, that's all fine, you want to make a satire, that's great. Even Darman says he's okay with people, you know, making fun of him, he's okay with people kind of, you know, uh, making light of it, and that's all good, I mean, that shows, you know, a, a, a bigger person he is, I think. And I'm trying to think, there, there's a few other channels that do this that, that have this life lesson channels there's soul snack which still soul snack sorry soul snack is all right it, it's a decent enough channel with again it's a channel that has some pretty good actors in there um when it comes to kid actors in some of these videos 
I know it's a crapshoot whenever you get kid actors in, you know, a life lesson channel video. Usually with Darman, he seems to have some really good actors. With life lessons, with uh, Louise, which is one I failed to mention, and Smear Bavanati, these kids are not. They're not actors. Uh, again, I'm not trying to down, you know, kid actors or anything like that. And it's just like, you can kind of tell, like, okay, there's one video where it felt like this, this actor just now heard the lines and is just saying them on the first take and not even trying to put emotion into it. But, you know, that's, that's not here or there. My, my point that I'm trying to make is, if you're going to do a life lesson channel, I'm not saying try to be like Darman, but at least put effort into the content that you're making. At least, you know, have it feel like, okay, we are trying to make a decent video, we're trying to tell a decent message. That, that's all it is, about effort. That's all I am trying to say. Put effort into your videos, into the content that you're making, and maybe tweak the story a little bit. Because the pro another thing is, a lot of the videos tend to be the same thing. And for a while, Darman hit this, where it seemed like every single video was the same exact message, the same exact scenario, the same exact setup. It was just remakes or reboots of previous videos. I remember that there was a... Uh, there was a time where he basically did the same concept in the same setting for at least five or s seven different videos. And again, this was back in early days of Darman when he didn't have the studio yet. It was just like them filming guerrilla style, you know, filmmaking. Which, hey, I have no problems with that. Guerrilla style filmmaking, go for it. But the thing is with Darman is he's grown and he's tried to improve himself. He's tried to improve and make better content. In fact, I think the content I like more from Darman is the behind the scenes videos. Like seeing what goes into making the videos and seeing how the actors react or you know, interact with one another. It's great. It actually makes me feel like, oh, hey, this is a fun atmosphere. This is an atmosphere that's pleasant. It seems like everybody's getting along well. Which, uh, you know, is somewhat rare in a professional studio set, I think. But all in all, what I'm trying to say is, if you're going to make a life, life lesson channel, effort is the, effort goes a long way. You put effort into the video, you put effort into the script writing, you put effort into the editing, you put effort in everything. If you just put a little bit of effort into what you're going to make, the product is going to end up ten times better. Uh, that's all I'm trying to say. But then again, with some of the other channels, I feel like they're just doing it to ride a trend and to break in that ad revenue. <sighs> anyway, that's uh, that's all I got right now. It was just something that was on my mind. So I hope you like this improv to uh, ramble, rant, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> anyway, you guys stay safe. You guys have a great 2022, and I'll be back with another video in the future. Hopefully talking about something else. Um, but, but a quick thing, there is going to be some more short films and more movie reviews and just more videos coming from me soon. So anyway, you guys stay safe. And until then, I'll catch you all later. Also, also, this is a big one. Uh, if you haven't yet, please consider donating to my Ko-fi page. If you guys want to see better videos, better content, and future short films, or even, at one point, hopefully, fingers crossed, a feature-length film, please consider donating to the my Kofi page. It's gonna The link for it is going to be down below, and I'll put the link somewhere right here in the middle of the video. Anyway, till then, I'll see you guys later.